News begins with breaking news. Breaking first at 10, a standoff leads to a fatal deputy-involved shooting. It happened this evening on Fort Myers Beach. The Lake County Sheriff's Office says a woman pointed a gun at deputies, and they had no choice but to fire. Wink News was first on the scene tonight. The night beat John Carlos Estrada live at the beach with the late-breaking details. John Carlos. Oh, Chris and Amanda, the sheriff's office had a press conference shortly before 9 o'clock. They said that their deputy feared for his life. Ma'am, please step outside and speak with us. We're not here to hurt you. A standoff with deputies on Fort Myers Beach tonight. Neighbors told us it was a chaotic scene as they were rushed away to safety. The cops told me there was three of them behind the tree, and they basically told me to run down the street with my arms in the air, and I ran down there, and they put me in the back of the cop car. Ma'am, please come speak with us. We're not here to hurt you. And they were engaged by a female subject who was armed. Neighbors told us deputies were called out to the scene along Lazy Way around 5 p.m. Once they arrived, a woman pointed a rifle at deputies. Our deputy feared for his life and safety, and he discharged his firearm. LCSO says the woman died from her gunshot wound, but their deputy is okay. Our deputy is uninjured, and I will tell you that it's an open, active investigation. I can hear tonight, but unfortunately, there is one person who did not survive the incident. And as you can see, they are still out here, and a lot of questions remain over what happened and how this all escalated into a deputy-involved shooting. They said that they'll be here all night trying to figure out those answers to those questions. Now, they do have a message for Fort Myers Beach residents. They want to tell them that they are safe tonight. Live on Night Beat, John Carlos Estrada, Wink News Now. John Carlos, thank you. Tonight, people